In our previous videos, we explored quantum theory and the breakthrough in quantum tunneling. Today, we dive into a game-changing quantum tech from the University of Colorado, Denver. Created by Assistant Professor Akash Sahai, this innovation could shrink particle accelerators, like the Large Hadron Collider, down to the size of a microchip. Still in early stages, it promises to revolutionize medicine with ultra-precise cancer treatments and open new frontiers in physics, even hinting at the possibility of a multiverse. Let's explore in this video how this could reshape science and medicine. Historically, producing ultra-intense electromagnetic fields required enormous infrastructures, such as the LHC, which spans miles and costs billions of dollars. The LHC and similar facilities are necessary for conducting high-energy experiments, but they are not only expensive, they are also inaccessible to most research institutions due to the scale of the infrastructure involved. Akash Sahai's breakthrough takes this well-established principle and condenses it into a device no larger than a thumb. The key to this innovation lies in extreme plasmons, a phenomenon where electrons oscillate rapidly in a material, generating intense electromagnetic fields. While these fields are typically created on a large scale, Sahai's silicon-based material can produce them on a chip. By controlling the rapid electron movement within the material and managing the heat generated during this process, Sahai's team has made it possible to generate petavolt per meter energy densities that were previously confined to massive particle accelerators. This breakthrough makes it possible to carry out the same types of high-energy experiments previously conducted in large facilities, but in a much more compact and cost-effective form. This miniaturization could drastically reduce the cost and complexity of conducting high-energy experiments, making this technology not just an achievement in physics, but a game-changer in terms of accessibility. Instead of large-scale facilities, this quantum technology could enable smaller labs and universities around the world to perform cutting-edge experiments. The applications of Sahai's quantum technology are vast, with the potential to transform both the medical and scientific landscapes. In medicine, one of the most promising applications of this technology is the development of gamma-ray lasers. Gamma-ray lasers could potentially be used to target and destroy cancer cells at the atomic level, offering a much more precise form of cancer treatment. Unlike conventional treatments, which often harm healthy tissue surrounding cancerous cells, this precision could drastically reduce side effects and improve recovery times. In addition to precision treatments, this technology could revolutionize medical imaging. By allowing us to observe cellular structures at the atomic level, scientists and doctors could gain unprecedented insights into the molecular processes within the body. Such imaging could make it possible to detect diseases earlier, improving treatment outcomes and potentially saving lives. In physics, on the physics side, the ability to perform high-energy experiments on a microchip opens up new possibilities for studying fundamental questions about the universe. One of the most exciting areas of research that this technology could facilitate is the study of dark matter. Dark matter, which makes up a significant portion of the universe's mass, has been elusive to scientists for decades. Currently, research into dark matter requires massive, expensive particle accelerators. But with this new chip-scale technology, researchers could simulate the conditions of the early universe and conduct experiments that offer deeper insights into how dark matter behaves. This technology could also test the multiverse theory, the idea of infinite parallel universes. Currently untestable with existing methods, Sahai's quantum breakthrough could offer the precision needed to experiment and potentially redefine our understanding of reality. The significance of this breakthrough extends beyond just its immediate applications. 
By making it possible to conduct high-energy experiments with small, affordable devices, Sahai's innovation could lead to a paradigm shift in the way scientific research is done. Currently, high-energy physics requires expensive, large-scale facilities that are often out of reach for most research institutions. But by shrinking this technology down to the size of a microchip, this quantum breakthrough could democratize access to cutting-edge scientific tools, enabling a wider range of institutions to participate in high-energy experiments. In addition to making high-energy physics more accessible, this technology could lead to advancements across multiple fields. Just as the laser revolutionized telecommunications and medical imaging, Sahai's chip scale accelerator could have wide-ranging applications from materials science to energy production. Its ability to perform high-energy experiments with precision and at a lower cost could open up new frontiers in scientific discovery, especially in fields like quantum computing, nanotechnology, and energy research. While the potential is clear, it's important to acknowledge that this technology is still in the early stages of development. Real-world applications, whether in medicine or physics, will take time to materialize. Sahai and his team continue to refine the technology with plans to improve the stability of the silicon material and optimize the energy flow for practical use. However, the progress made so far lays the foundation for a transformative leap in multiple fields. The next challenge is scaling this breakthrough for real-world use, from cancer treatments to testing theories about the universe's structure. Despite the challenges, Sahai is optimistic that within his lifetime, this technology could become a standard tool in medicine and science. We may soon see gamma ray lasers for precise treatments and small scale particle accelerators in research worldwide. The quantum technology from the University of Colorado, Denver could revolutionize both medicine and physics. By shrinking particle accelerators to microchip size, it opens new possibilities for high energy experiments and precision cancer treatments. While real world applications are still years away, today's progress paves the way for a new era in science and healthcare. The future holds exciting breakthroughs. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more updates on scientific innovations. See you in the next video.